Yo, what's up folks? This is Rondell. Um today my video I want to talk to you guys about right now, right here, right now, is what is your major definite purpose? I know some of you are personal development buffs, you've read uh Think and Grow Rich and all that type of stuff, so you probably already know what I'm talking about. But if you don't, then that's what the purpose of this video is about defining and understanding your major definite purpose what is your major definite purpose what is it that you want why do you want it how bad do you want it that's what you need to determine to be able to accomplish what you want to accomplish today was an awkward day for me uh, I do work a regular job on top of internet marketing for those of you that didn't know uh, and I hate getting up in the morning I cannot stand waking up in the morning but this morning I woke up actually I was awaken or awoken I don't know if awoken is a word I don't care really but I was awakened early in the morning this morning and I went to bed around 6 in the morning and I got woke up at 9 and it was my day off normally on my day off I wake up when I feel like waking up but today something inside me said just get up and see what you can accomplish this morning and then you do, when it's time to go to bed you go to bed or whatever you know but this morning when I got up I dialed into a call that I knew goes on Monday through Friday at 9 in the morning every day called the, uh, called the Think and Grow Rich um, mindset call and it's held by a guy named Paul Hutchins and some other guys that I follow on the internet these guys are super successful so I'm like hey I'm up it's nine o'clock how about I get on some mindset you know so today they discussed uh, what is your major definite purpose in life you know what are what what do you want and how strongly do you believe that it's possible for it to be attained so the question I'm asking you is what do you want and how badly do, or how strongly do you believe that it can be attained because if you don't believe you can attain it then you might as well just let it go but check this out so I was looking on my desk and I saw this this is a book and I have a new goal my new goal is to read my book that I've never read about goals can you believe that how how oxymoronish is that <laughs> so anyway um, I decided to open this book and the reason that I'm doing this video is because I decided that I was gonna open this book I was gonna find something inside of it that was worth making a video about so I opened the book and to my surprise on chapter 6 this might look backwards for you guys but on chapter 6 it says decide upon your major definite purpose so that's the second time today that I've seen this message now I'm not extremely religious but to those of you who are some people call that confirmation when you have a message a strong message it hits you at one point and then later on in the day or maybe later on in the week or the month or whenever you get the exact same message brought back in front of you again so what I took from this is that it's imperative for me to decide upon my major definite purpose and I think it's the same for you now I want to read you this little quote here from Napoleon Hill and Napoleon Hill is actually the author of Think and Grow Rich the book if you don't have it you need to get it go on Amazon and look it up it should be dirt cheap and there's free PDFs for it all over Google too just type uh, think and grow rich PDF if you like reading PDFs I don't I'm not a big fan of PDFs um, alright so it says there is one quality <clears throat> excuse me they says it says there is one quality which one must possess to win and that is definiteness of purpose the knowledge of what one wants and a burning desire to possess it let's read that again there is one quality which one must possess to win and that is definiteness of purpose the knowledge of what one wants and a burning desire to possess it so what do you want 
Do you want a nicer home? Do you want a nice car? Do you want uh, a better relationship? Do you want to go to school? Do you want to be a millionaire? Do you want to be a billionaire? You know, uh, once you once you've uh, decided what it is that you want, is now now it's time for you to decide what you're willing to do to possess it. Do you have a burning desire to do whatever it takes to a, accomplish your goal, or is it just something that you just let fall by the wayside? You have to really make that determination on your on your own. I I, I obviously can't do that for you, but what is important is for you to decide what you truly want and then if you when you when you uh, one way to break this down is if you want a new house why do you want the new house do you want the new house because it's pretty on the outside or do you want the new house because it'll give you a sense of pride and accomplishment and being a homeowner but and if that's so what is the what is the sense of accomplishment or pride that you derive from being a homeowner is it the fact that uh, your your mother or father never owned a home for themselves and then you took it upon yourself to use that as a way to feel like you've made it in life you know you have to really be you have to really break down your desires because once you get to the core of your desire that's what will really give you the push and the, and the uh, ammunition to to push through to try and get what it is that you want and once you have that burning desire and you have the belief that it's possible it's almost guaranteed to come to you if you work for it so that's pretty much it on this video if you may if this made sense i want you to click the subscribe button on my uh... youtube channel um, you can also follow me on facebook at join my facebook i'm, I'm sorry you join my fan page dot com you can follow me on facebook and then too uh, before you go, if you have a major definite purpose to to create more income and you don't have a vehicle, you don't have a strategy or methodology of getting more money, then I encourage you to click on the link that's below this video because that's what I do. I, I work constantly on different ways that I can increase my income and if increasing your income is something that you that you feel would uh, be beneficial for you, then I believe I have something that you want to see might be for you might not doesn't really matter but I encourage you to click the link and find out for yourself so with that said I hope you got something out this video and I will talk to you guys on another video see you later